Mars here today and this is going to be a bit of a different video. Um, I started collecting a new magazine. It's issue 6 so it's not long come out. Um, I, I don't know if it's monthly or anything. It doesn't really say when the next issue comes out. But it is oops, the Num Nums, Num Nums magazine. So I'm going to show you what this issue 6 came with and then we'll look at some stuff that's inside it. So you get a magazine, it costs £4.10 for the magazine. And there's loads of stuff you can do, which I'll show you in a minute. So it came with... A little notebook it does come with a lock which is here so here's the lock I hate these locks but it's just from a kiddie diary anyway so it comes with a, with a lock and it also comes with a pen Um, this is a glitter pen and it's centered and it has a num num sticker on it, but it smells a bit like strawberry. To me, it does. Um, I did write in here. I wrote my dog's name, but um, I kind of wrote somewhere else there, which yeah. It's not a swear word or anything or nothing private, but um, yeah, I don't know what people are gonna think with that word. But I swear it's nothing rude or swear word or whatever. Because I wouldn't do that on my videos. So and it also comes with a sticker. Now I don't know if this is centered or not. Um, but I don't want to open it. I just want to keep it in the pack. You can't really spell much for the pack. But I'm, I'm not quite sure. So and okay, where it's not reflected so it's shiny there's like one two big stickers and then a few little ones little love heart ones and it also came with some rings now i know these are kitty rings they don't fit my fingers at all because they're for tiny fingers they'll fit my little finger but i don't wear rings anyway um Okay, there's seven rings and they all have different patterns on. Um, I don't want this video to be too long because of the internet is quite it's going quite slow. But there's one, two, three, four, five. And seven and it also comes with a keyring but mine's in my bag so I just took a photo of it so you guys can see it this way and it is quite big as well in there it's white if if it looks a bit yellowy but it's actually white so that's the keyring now let's just quickly take a look at the things we can do inside and as num nums um, are like food so there's loads of stuff you can make including food in here so also as it's coming up Christmas on the first page here you can make your own Christmas tags tags are there and also at the back of the magazine you can also make um oh my god what are they called paper chain and then it also tells you about uh, what's in the next issue okay so let's just have another quick look through what we can do now i don't really do activities in magazines if i find something that you know catches my eye then maybe okay so some uh, food things here. So the first one um, looks like that is a marshmallow. 
They're called Mel Mellow Pops. So you push a cocktail stick into a marshmallow, dip it into the melted chocolate, then into the sprinkles and leave it to set. And also, which does look quite yummy here, but I have to be careful of what chocolate, well, chocolate I have, because I get really bad heartburn of whatever I eat. And I can't have cookies, unless it's the wheat free. So you need cookies, marshmallows, and chocolate spread. I'm not sure if I like bake it or anything just to make it melt, but that's another recipe in there. Um, there's some more here. And also, you can do a word search, or whatever you call it. So you can make, for the ingredients of this one, you need 200 grams of melted chocolate, marshmallows, sprinkles and cocktail sticks. And there's some different marshmallows on a stick there. And then, uh, for the ingredients for this one, you need 30 millilitres of milk, 50 grams of white chocolate, pink food colouring, marshmallows and sprinkles and for that there. So there's loads of baking things you can do. Um, what are these? I'm not sure what they do. Uh, fortune cookie so here you can make your own fortune cookie and it shows you how to do it here um, and also it comes with a 2018 planner it's not a full calendar it's just two pages of the years in not years the months in and then on that month you just mark down what you have planned for that month so it has a few things down like january new year's day february pancake day valentine's day march mother's day april easter sunday june father's day october halloween november bonfire night and december christmas and it's only christmas next week comment down below if you're excited um so that's that and you can cut it out my voice will go in funny then. And then stick it on your wall. And here, if you like to read, it comes with a little story inside. I don't really read. That's just my life. <coughs> my life is very boring. And it comes with a poster on the back of the story, if you want to cut that out. And here, there's prizes, if you want to enter and win things. Um... So what's the time are we on? Eight minutes, so I need to quickly wrap up this video. Um, food colouring, I think you could just like, oops, colour that in. And then, yeah, there's a maze you can do. And then here, you can enter to win a prize. I think you just do, just do a drawing or something if you want to enter an maze there. So we've come to the end of the magazine now and I think that is everything and here it has like items and it shows you like prices of them and where some, some shops it came from like this dress is from H&M I don't think I've ever been in that shop before um, so yeah it shows you the prices and everything so Right, that is it for the magazine then. I think we've gone through everything. And then also on the back it just says what's in this magazine. So, yeah, I know it's not much of a video that I usually would do, but um, I just don't know what videos to do at the moment because I don't get comments of ideas, which I'm not really complaining about. Um, I know I'm not that popular on YouTube, which is probably fine by me anyway. But for me making videos, it's really brung out my confidence. When I first started YouTube, I was a little bit nervous. And that was like in 2015, I started YouTubing. 
and then over the years I've come out of my shell because like with school and everything I got uh, really bullied and I had no confidence at all. I still haven't got that much confidence inside me but I've got enough confidence to put myself out on YouTube. So yeah, so YouTube it's really helped me a lot to come out. Um, so yeah. So thanks for watching everyone, please subscribe if you want to see more, rate, comment, and I'll do another video soon.